the blood of Jesus cleanses our sins and makes it possible for us to be holy to come before God. Don't look at somebody and say, these are the people who qualify. No. It's the blood that qualifies all of us. You can be as anointed as any man of God if only you can believe that you are standing before the throne of grace. In this message series titled, The Blood of Jesus, Kakra Bading explains how covenants can also be made with God as was in the case of Abraham. You also discover how the blood of Jesus gives us access into the presence of God. Grab a copy for yourself and a loved one this Easter season. Place your order on Facebook by posting Order the Blood of Jesus at the comment section or message window. This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakra Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakra Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakra is the senior pastor of the Morning Star Cathedral, Lighthouse Chapel International, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Welcome. Kakra has been sharing on the subject, the blood of Jesus with the subtitle, Boldness. Today, he will be sharing on how to approach God in boldness in order to obtain miracles. Number two. I realize when you come before God, you want miracles. You need what? Boldness. You know, if you read the scriptures and you examine the miracles of Jesus, there is no miracle where boldness was not demonstrated and confidence before God was not demonstrated. For example, turning water into wine. His mother said unto him, they have no wine. His mother said unto them, whatsoever he says unto you, do it. Jesus said, fill the water pots with water. They fill them up to the brim. You need boldness to tell people to fill containers with water and it will turn into Alvaro a malt. <laughs> when the ruler of the feast, verse 10 says, had tasted the water which was made wine and knew not whence it was, but the servant knew, the ruler of the feast called the bridegroom and said, every man at the beginning does set forth good wine. And it's like that. Every party at the beginning, everything is in abundance. The drinks, the fish, everything. Party starts at 12, better get there at 11.30. You get everything. But by the time it is 7 o'clock, you see the quality of the party begins to go down. When you come and you are late, they'll say we have only plain rice and shito. We can boil egg if you don't mind. Boldness. Imagine Jesus taking Peter into the middle of the sea and telling him, let down your net for a draft. Open seal. You have not seen any fish. I mean, you must be very bold before you can make such a statement. Peter said in verse 5, Master, we have toiled all night and have taken nothing. Nevertheless, at thy way, I will let down the net. Miracles just don't come. They come with acts of boldness and confidence before God. Otherwise, you will never see miracles. Lazarus, Martha said to Jesus, Lord, by this time he stinketh, he has been dead for this. Jesus said, said not I not unto thee, John eleven forty, that if thou wouldest believe, thou wouldest see the glory of God. Jesus said, take away the stone. Imagine you're going for a funeral. The dead body is right there in the coffin. They are about to take him away. Ping pong, ping pong. He said, hey, the motor kid, everything should stop. Bring the coffin out. Listen, you better be sure of what you are doing. <laughs> but you see, with that confidence and boldness before God, you can't say something like this. Jesus lifted up his eyes and said, Father, I thank you that you have heard me. I know that you hear me always, but because of the people who stand by, I said it, that they may believe that God has sent me. 43 says, 
when he had thus spoken, he carried a loud voice. Lazarus, come out! And he that was dead came forth, bound hand and foot with grief clothes. His face was bound in a napkin. Jesus said, loose him and let him go. Everywhere you see a miracle, you see extreme boldness before God. Otherwise, it will not happen. Thanks for joining us. Today we learned that we need boldness when we approach God in order to receive miracles. Join us same time tomorrow as Kakra continues this message. Before we leave, here is a praise report to boost your faith in the Lord. I am now employed. Dear Kakra, I had been jobless for a year and on Sunday 1st October, some sheets of paper were given to us to write our prayer requests on. I wrote for you to pray for me to secure a good job. Days after, a company I attended an interview at almost six months ago called me to come and start work. I don't even know what to say. Glory be to God. Time. You can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full length message or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to plus 233 55 700 Send an email to info at .org. You can also make a regular call or send a text to plus 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you.